Hello everyone! Hello guys! Today we are going to prepare an excellent side dish. Chicory! Yes, it's a sprouted chicory. And I will show you how when sometimes a side dish could be also a main dish. How you see it's the final result. And we will show you how we reach this final result. Enjoy! To prepare this recipe that is side dish, we need, of course, sprouted chicory. This is how you found the sprouted chicory uh, at the shop. This is the final result, you see, or curved. Of course, we need garlic, anchovies, olive oil, uh, vinegar from the farmer, and uh, this is a tool. We are going to make our puntarelle. So first thing, I cut the bottom of the chicory and I'm going to take all the puntarelle, okay? So these are the puntarelle, so now I need to clean and to take all the puntarelle. This chicory is ready, we cut just the, the other part as we show you and also the round part we use it to boil like normal chicory, okay? This hard part we cut to be tender and with this we draw. This is the tool that we are going to use. It's uh, you can find on the internet and it's really the cut puntarelle, so the cut points of uh, uh, chicory. And the way is like this. You take this one, you with a little bit of force, and you see it's coming the puntarelle. I'll show you again. Allora, the puntarelle uh, that I cut, they are like straight. Uh, needs time to, to be curved and also need cold water. You can put also some uh, uh, ice if you want. The final results will come after 3-4 hours and it will be like this, curved. We prepare the condiment for the puntarelle, the point, okay, or chicken. So we just cut the garlic very, very thin. Okay. We put the garlic in a bowl, then we took some anchovies okay. and then we put our vinegar from the farmer. Okay. We like very vinegar. And then our organic olive oil, our production. Okay. And we add also some salt. Okay, our puntarelle are ready, now I put some anchovies, so you know what the is inside. And they are ready to eat. Thanks for following this video recipe. Now let's go and match the plate with a wine from the castle of Oppiano which is only 10 minutes walking from here. Okay, we are here, finally the plate is ready and uh, here we have uh, this uh, chicory sprout uh, with the anchovies and now Gabriele coming from the Pupiano Castle, he matched it with another excellent uh, wine, uh, sparkling wine. Hello, uh, so now we are talking about bubbles because uh, with vegetables and uh, especially uh, vegetables like this with uh, some tasty complementary ingredients like anchovies, uh, we need uh, to have uh, a sparkling wine uh, like this based on Manzoni grape. Manzoni grape is a typical um, Italian uh, grape uh, that is a crossing between uh, Pinot, white Pinot, Pinot Bianco and, and Riesling and is a very very aromatic uh, sparkling wine so uh, uh, it's very intense uh, on the nose and uh, with a very very elegant bubble so not too strong in the mouth and this, uh, this bubble helps to uh, appreciate uh, this dish that is very simple but very 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 tasty so uh, sparkling wine like manzoni with uh, uh, the note of uh, uh, white fruit and flowers uh, 
give you the perfect uh, pairing to this uh, cycle uh, dish.